Hi, today we're going to be talking about nonfiction signposts. These are signposts when you're reading nonfiction texts that will help you to become a closer reader. The signpost we're going to be talking about today is numbers and stats. Numbers and stats is when an author uses specific numbers or amounts or provide statistical information, like When you notice a number in stat, you should stop and ask yourself, why did the author use these numbers or amounts? It is important to note that numbers and stats do not always need to be specific numbers or amounts. The author may use numerals and words, as well as indefinite quantities such as many, most, some, taller than, etc. Let's look at an example. Garana and her family have lived in their one-room house for two years. It's one of thousands of mud-brick homes in the Shamshatu Afghan refugee camp. The camp hosts 50,000 Afghan refugees. I see that Garana's house has only one room, which tells me that it is very small, and that she's lived there for two years, which seems like a long time to live in such a small house. I also see that her home is one of thousands in the camp, and that there are 50,000 refugees living there, which tells me that there are a lot of refugees just like Garana. When we notice numbers and stats when we are reading, it is important to stop and ask ourselves, why did the author use these numbers or amounts? Created using Powtoon.